Welcome back to H3 Weapon Deep Dive, and I, I know you've been waiting for it. We are finally on to the muzzle loading category of rifles. Home SMG rifle muzzle loading. This is the brown best chambered in 69 caliber ball. Insert joke here. We've got flint in this game. That is a flint. Yeah. Oh boy, we've got flint, we've got meat horns, because you need that in your life. Get out of here. Powder flasks, flints, shot, paper cartridges. Oh boy, this is going to be a fun one. Ah, you don't get this in your average shooter, do you? All right, let's check it out. So I've already got a video covering the flintlock pistol, its controls and attachments and whatnot, and the brown bass functions identically to it. It's even chambered in the same caliber. So rather than going over that uh, whole, whole deal, which is about six minutes long, I will link to the video for the flintlock pistol that covers all that stuff. And it, it's a pretty good video too. I just rewatched it and yeah, it, it holds up. Anyway, so I will be showing the differences between the pistol version and the rifle version. Uh, and I will also be attempting a snipe test of it. <laughs> Gonna be rough. All right, here we go. So obviously the brown bess is a rifle. So we've got a proper stock on it like so. We also have a grab point that's right around here. There we go for the front of it like so. Okay, so you can hold it by that when you're trying to load it because it has a very long barrel and is a giant pain in the buttocks to load. So let's see if it can snipe. Let's see what the accuracy is like on this thing. We've got our target way out there at 400 meters. Let's see if we can hit it five out of 10 times in the target area. Oh, wish me luck. All right, here we go. First shot. It does have a front post out there. It's going to cover up the target. I'm going to take a guess. And who knows where it went? All right, you know what? This is hopeless. I'm going to try it 100 meters. All right, let's try this again. I'm going to try sniping it at 100 meters so I have a chance in hell of getting it there. Let's see how this does. Hey, now we're talking. I can't see the front sight. Against, haha, <laughs> nearly got it. Hey. Nice. Oh, missed. Did I get it? No. Ah. Oh. Oh, I missed completely. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh. Oh. Ended up with four, so didn't even get it at a hundred meters. Well, that's a shame. Look at that. Oh, that barely. One, two, three, four, and that didn't count. Oh, one, two, three, four. Ah, so close at a hundred meters. Almost at a hundred meters. Well, after reloading this thing about 12 times, it's uh, got a nice pattern going here. Let me show you how I'm doing it. I'm holding it with my off hand on the uh, stock here. Now I'm going to click left on the trackpad to bring it to half cock. Pan is open. I'm going to grab my paper cartridge, bite the tip off. Super gross. Left click, or rather, <laughs> left click. It's not a mouse, you dummy. <laughs> Trigger click. One, put it in the pan. And I'm just going to swipe my hand over the pan and close it. There it goes. This goes in the end, 
And again, I'm holding with my off hand to drag it down and then drop the whole thing in at once. There it goes, ball and powder. And if I can find my stick, here we go. I'm going to put it in the end and then I'm just going to drag it down with my controller. I'm not really going to click or do anything special. I'm just going to put it in the end, drag the controller down. It goes down real fast like that. Now, bring it back up, down on the trackpad. Now I get the full cock and I'm ready to... The powder fell out. <sighs> All right, fine. Let's put some powder in it. There we go. Close the top. There it goes. All right. And now we're ready to go. Where's my target? Oh, hit it right in the button. <laughs> there you have it, the brown bass. Ugh. It's a flintlock. Till next time, I will see ya. Let's see if I can blow up that crate. Yeah, at least it's got some power. Let's see if it'll fly. Will you fly? That's all right.